Most of us eat at least three meals a day. And the power to chew all that food comes from a muscle in your jaw called the orbicularis oris. When you turn on and off the lights or draw your curtains open and close, you get the power to do these tasks from the muscles in your arms called biceps. You get the power to do sit-ups from the muscles in your belly called the rectus abdominis. And you get the power to lift heavy things from a group of muscles called deltoids, pectoralis majors and biceps. Amazing, isn't it? Well, did you know you also have the power to persevere? You have the power to do right, even when it's hard. You have the power to keep going, even when you're tired. You have the power to work hard at something, even when you feel like quitting. You've been doing all that stuff for years, but you probably never knew where the power to persevere came from, did you? The power to persevere doesn't come from your muscles. It comes only from God. That's right. When you are tired and worn out, God has the power you need. When you feel weak, God can give you strength to keep going. When you are exhausted and feel like giving up, God can help you persevere. For it is written, He will not grow tired or weary. And his understanding no one can fathom. He gives strength to the weary and increases the power of the weak. Even youths grow tired and weary and young men stumble and fall. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. They will run and not grow weary. They will walk and not be faint. If you trust in Him, He will help you persevere in everything you do.